What's up vlog? Hello? Welcome back to my life. I've been driving around for an hour trying to get to a mountain and I cannot figure out how to get to it. I'm now back at the spot that Charlie and I climbed. We climbed that. I'm basically just burning all my daylight. It's really frustrating. The mountain I want to get to, I've driven past like the place that I should have parked. I'm now around the back of it. But there might be a way to climb the back of it, is my thinking. If I can park close enough, I can probably start hiking it. So this mountain on the left here is the one I'm trying to climb. I should have climbed the back of it, but I thought it would take too long. I've only got about an hour of daylight left. So I want to climb this side of it if possible. So yeah, the original mountain I was looking for, I couldn't find a good trail up it. So we'll do this one instead. I could probably smash this out pretty fast. We'll see. I made this decision to not wear any shoes again. We'll see how that goes. Nice, nice, nice. So this is what I want to climb. It should take me about an hour. It doesn't look like a very difficult hike. It's taken me well over a week now to recover from the last one I did. With Charlie, that was intense. That's the one we did last time. It's just pure rock. Ice and rock. If we'd have waited until this week to do it, it would have been so lovely, but I did like the challenge. And it's amazing that she managed to do it barefoot as well. Like she's, she's such a badass for doing that. I never expect people to be barefoot with me, but she does that kind of stuff anyway. She managed to do the whole thing. So that's like the second mountain that we've done together barefoot. Pretty cool. I might be biting off more than I can chew today, but we'll see. I'm so stubborn. Like I refuse to not do something that I want to do. Today I wanted to hike. Yes, I wasted a lot of time. Yes, I woke up very late, but I still want to hike. I don't mind hiking down in the dark. It doesn't bother me at all. I've got extra clothes in case it gets cold. I've got plenty of water. And I got three cameras, so I'm doing this thing. It's so hard to like vlog as soon as I start walking because I have to catch my breath, get the rhythm going. I'll do my best. <laughs> I've never done this trail before, not from this side. I've been up the mountain on the other side. The other side's close to where I live. I want to bathe in these little streams so bad. I'm already really hot. Definitely overdressed today. Two jets just went past again. They practice through here, doing loops, doing laps, sorry. This is how high I've made it so far. I'm now in the shade of the mountain. Still very warm, completely out of breath. Because I'm doing this hike with a time crunch. I know if I don't hurry up, I'm not gonna be able to watch the sunset. Sunset's in one hour, so I need to get up there. It's not that far away though, it's very easy. Let's go around the back of it. I'm just watching this mountain that we did the other week. It's so intense. So rocky. I'll switch lenses in a, in a minute. 
show you guys what I mean, but I don't know how we did that. We did it fast too, because we only had a couple hours of daylight. Okay, enough talking. Keep walking. Still going up. There's all the sunlight back there. Still got a way to go to get, get to it. I do not have the energy to do this today. Yet, here I am. My stubbornness gets me to do things that I really don't want to do. <sighs> oh, look at that. Giant piece of quartz. <sighs> Been talking about the quartz quite a lot lately, but there's so much of it. Look, I found a vein up here in the mountain. See? There's all the way there. All of this. That's a lot of it. Oh man, I'm tired. <laughs> climbing behind me and I asked him if he's been up here before he said yeah and I asked well how much further is the top he said we're over halfway but it's not likely we're gonna catch the sunset it's a shame Kind of got lost on the way here. Probably would have made it. It's full on. It's like big steps each time. It's not really a walk. It's constant incline. So getting down would be easy. But this up bit sucks. It's a sunny day, but I choose to hike in the in the shade. My logic. I just want to lay down. This is really tough. No way. Oh, I made it. Yes. Wow. <laughs> Oh, I had plenty of time. <laughs> 6 06. The sun is still high in the sky. I'm higher than the mountain we did last week. That's a good feeling. That's a very good feeling. Charlie, if you're watching this, I beat it. I did it higher today. On a whim, that's not bad. There really wasn't much planning today. Now that I'm up here, flipping did it. <laughs> wow, I was, I didn't. This is high. This is really high up. Snowden is that one right there with a bit of snow on it. That's the tallest one in Wales. This is not much shorter than that. There's like five mi mountains in this area a bit bigger than me right now. <laughs> cool, I did it. I think if I ever come up here again, I'm gonna go up the other side. Seems a lot easier, but maybe a bit longer. 
right now and he's trying to get naked up here and take a picture. <laughs> Sweat on my back is getting really chilly now. <laughs> I want to get naked. I've got the, the shot all set up over there. But the guy that was hiking behind me is just over there and he can see everything. Okay, he's gone now. I'm gonna get naked. <laughs> I've been over there in the vlog. This one right here is Snowden. Nice. dressed now. <laughs> Just watching the sunset. I'm shooting a time lapse up there so that should be nice to watch. Wow. It looks like the sun's setting behind a mountain over there. So I don't I don't know Ireland too well but it's Ireland's over there. It looks like it's setting behind a mountain on Ireland right now. But I don't know if Ireland even has mountains on this side of the coast. I'll have to find out later. Either that or it's just a thick line of cloud over in Ireland right now wouldn't really make any sense. So why would they have cloud and us not? I don't try and understand the weather. It is what it is. It's probably being manipulated by us, but can't change any of that. I can't change anything when it comes to weather. I can just enjoy what I got. Nice. It's very rare that I get to just sit and enjoy a sunset on a mountain. Usually I'd be in such a hurry to get back down before the sun sets, but Today I'm embracing it. It's gonna be a night hike down. Same as last week. Luckily I brought enough clothes because it is pretty chilly. We're just stuck in the gravitational pull of that giant flaming ball. Can't really comprehend it. We just got lucky enough to be a certain distance away that it doesn't kill us or freeze us. And that's it. The sun is gone. Nice. Well, thanks for joining me up there, up here on this hike. I know I didn't talk too much because I was completely out of breath. <sighs> Time to run back down. <laughs> my toes and my face are so icy. It was really hot on the way up. <laughs> but then I was sitting in the wind for a while. Look how dramatic that looks. I suppose the reason I obsess so much over mountains is because it's like the biggest physical challenge I have around here. Obviously you've got other things which are a bit more mental, like swimming in the ocean, swimming in uh, rivers and lakes, they're freezing this time of year. Overcoming that mental hurdle is more of a challenge, but I just mean physically demanding. This is the hardest thing that I can do. Whenever I feel like crap, the hardest thing I can do is get up, get out of bed, Go hike the tallest thing you can find. <laughs> so when I actually achieve that, all the endorphins get go rushing through my body. Like I feel great right now. Granted I'm a bit freezing, but... So, uh, I heard someone say this once. Um, uh, cold is just a sensation. It doesn't have to be negative. It doesn't have to hurt you. It's just a sensation on your skin. So I try to not think of it as painful or uncomfortable. It's just a sensation. Just enjoy that sensation as it comes. So my fingers are tingly. They're not necessarily in pain. They're just tingly because I'm holding my camera out. My toes, they're starting to warm up now that I'm moving. Like it's okay. It's all just a sensation.
So I've been walking down in the dark this whole time for about almost an hour. It was really fun. Uh, the moon's just not high enough, so it's not giving me enough light right now. And it's cool because I can see all the stars coming out, but also all the people on the mountain opposite me, they're all coming down different paths. So it's really cool to see the little lights. So uh, yeah, I'm joining in, I guess. Someone is really high up, like it's probably still an hour out. Sucks to be them. It's so warm down here on the actual ow, dirt compared to up there. The sun being out all day managed to get the warm, get the earth really warm. So it's nice. I'm overdressed, feels good. Yeah, I didn't want to have to use a torch, but I lost the path and half the path is a river. So I didn't want to walk in the river. It'd be really difficult. So yeah, I'm using a light, unfortunately. I've been thinking the whole way down about my group hike where I invite you guys to come and join me on a hike and then we camp out for the night. I've been thinking about it. Um, this mountain that I just did, the other side of it has that forest, the forest I was talking about, the one where I want to camp in. So if we were to hike the mountain from the other side, which would take a couple hours, it's quite an easy hike, not as hard as what I just, just did right now. And then chill at the top for a little bit and then come down camp in the woods. I think that'd be really easy and really nice. Yeah, but thinking about it, I, I need to set up a date. I want to do it before I move because obviously I want to come back to do it. So let me let me think a little bit more about the details. We've got some good weather here now. I need to give you guys a bit, bit of notice as well. I don't want to do it. I don't want to just throw it on you. Give you guys at least a week to uh, take time off work or whatever you got to do. Um, I'll probably do it on a weekend. I'm just thinking about it. I need to get the details correct. It's not easy organizing something. Like I'm not, I'm not the best at it, but I, I just want to hike with you guys. I think it'd be fun. Check out what I just found. Loads and loads of rusty metal. It's like a saw, some springs. What is that? Weird. It's just in between these two, these two rocks. Um, I'm lost. I took the wrong path and I can see where my car is, but I don't know how to get there. There's a house here with no lights on. Yeah, I just don't know <laughs> how to get back to my car. <laughs> ah, coming down in the dark is so, so much harder than you think it would be. There is a path here, but it's not the path I came up. It's like a bridge that I don't remember crossing. Oh well, we'll just do it. So tired. I sat outside of my car for like 20 minutes. I just didn't have the strength just to get up, come in the house. I need a shower and just, I don't know, man. Something bad happened. So I just got done doing like a Discord exclusive live stream because I didn't have the energy to go on Twitch. And um, I go to check my YouTube channel, the vlog from yesterday, it was posted in 360p for some reason. It's not. It wasn't supposed to be. It was supposed to be 4K. I uploaded everything in 4K. It was in 360p. Had like 50 comments, and it got copyright claimed. See, so got copyright claimed. So I'm having to. I had to cut out the bit that got copyrighted. It's like a tiny little piece of music, and hopefully this time it posts in 4K, which is frustrating because it's now 1 a.m. I haven't eaten yet because I'm stressed by this, and I need to edit today's video, which is this one that you're watching right now. I post this one right afterwards, so please go watch this, the one I just re-uploaded because now it's not going to have any views. That's just, it's just really annoying. I don't know why it's posting 360p and no one said anything. Please text me or tweet me or just get me a message somehow to tell me, hey, my video is broken today and I'll fix it. Because I just didn't know. I went hiking. <laughs> I didn't know it was broken. Basically, I, I, get, I get tweet notifications if anybody tweets me. So if you want to get my attention, that's the best way to do it. Just tweet me anything, whatever, anything goes wrong. Yeah, any, anything wrong with the video, please let me know because I'd like to fix it. <sighs> so annoying. <laughs> anyway, the hike was beautiful. I need to eat now, but I'm just gonna end the vlog here because I don't think I've got anything else to say. I appreciate you guys. Um, I had a good chat with, with Pop this evening. She's basically telling me, just order the pants. Don't worry about moving right now. Order the pants because the longer I put it off, the longer I'm going to be stuck here. And she's right.
Like, look at how many things I need to do, but I'm just not doing. I'm ignoring all the post-it notes. They're right here in front of me, and I'm ignoring them. So many things I'm supposed to be doing. I'm getting a bit overwhelmed. Okay, bye-bye. See you tomorrow.